morning. So, welcome to another workout with Worthington, where I am your trainer, Worthington, of course, showing you another workout that you can do at home utilizing your own equipment, your own space, and most importantly, your own proper body techniques and proper body mechanics. Um, so this workout is a really ch challenging, challenging, excuse me, endurance workout. Uh, the workout will consist of an accumulation um, downgrade or, or a de-accumulation um, in the workout, which you would start off doing 100 reps of an exercise, then 90 reps of an exercise, 80 reps of an exercise, all four and so on, all the way down until you get to 10. If you complete that 10 within the hour, you start right back up at 90 this time. And you do the 90 reps, or the 90, yeah, the 90 reps of that exercise, and the 80 of the next, crossing out that 100. That's right, you do not have to repeat the 100 exercise, or the 100 reps of the first exercise, second time. So, you wanna see the workout? Well, here it is, yes. Zoom in, take your pig, get ready, because this is what you're gonna be doing. You're gonna be doing 100 inchworms, 90 happy sacks, 80 squat pulses, 70 butt kicks, 60 fast jacks, 50 Johnny C's, 40 plank kicks, 30 supermans, 20 wide push-ups, 10 hard crunches, and if you're in a field or anywhere like that, or if you have a treadmill, give me a nice lap. If you want to make this like an extraordinary moment in your workout and you really want to push yourself, put a lap in between each exercise set. So therefore, if you do your 100 um, inchworms, you're going to go down and do a lap. Then you're going to come back and do 90 of your, um, excuse me, 90 of your hacky sacks. Then you're going to come back and do your 80. Lap 70, so forth and so forth. So let me show you how this work exercise looks. So we're gonna start off with the 100 inch arms. You're gonna be at the back of your mat. You're gonna be standing stretched straight back like this. We're just giving you a little light right here so you get a good, a good view. There we go. And all you're gonna do is crawl out and crawl back. That's all you're gonna do 100 times. Yeah, your shoulders will feel this by the time you're at 70. But keep going. So then you're gonna come back and you're gonna do into these hacky sacks. Lap or your or not, your choice. Hacky sacks are very simple. Pretend there's a hacky sack ball if you've ever played it. I know if you've ever seen kids play it, it's all of a little ball and all you're doing is touching the back of your heel. Just like this. 90 of those. 80 squat pulses. So I'm gonna show you from the side angle. What you wanna do, nicely, form maybe, feet, point it forward. Position your knees just a little bit more than shoulder width apart and pulse, 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 pulse. Give me 80 of those. Yes, that's all I want to see, pulsing the whole time. You'll feel it in your butt, trust me. Then you're going to come up. You're going to do butt kicks. You want to make sure the heel is kicking that butt cheek. Just like that. Nice. That's all you're going to do. You're going to do 70 of those, 35 on each leg. You're going to come back. Come back to your board, if you've written it down. We're now at 60, so you're gonna be doing 60 fast shacks. One, two, three, four, five, all the way up to 60. You'll come back to your mat. You'll do what's called Johnny C's. You'll be in a plank position, going down on your elbows, up on your hands. Here's a demonstration. I'm starting at a plank position. I'm going down on my elbows, Coming up on my hands, that was one. Back up, two. Then I go down to my 40 of plank kicks. So these are nice. So this also helps with the abs and the glutes. All you wanna do is be in a plank position, and I'll show you from behind. Kicking this one up, alternating, or hitting one side at a time. You're gonna, do you're gonna do 20 on each leg, total of 40. You're coming down to your supermans. You're gonna be on your mat. You're gonna be raising your arms and legs up off the mat and flying like your superman. So you go down to your mat. 
and you'll fly out. You'll come up, then you'll have 20 push-ups left. So if you really want to be successful after you've done those 30 supermans, go right into your wide push-ups. Put some space between your hands. One, two, three, bust 20 out. You'll come down to your mat. You'll finish off strong with 10 hard crunches. Very simple, not too bad. Just all you gotta do is 10, count them down. Arms go up behind your head. Legs go up off the ground. You bring them in to you, crunch up and out. That was one, crunch up and out. That's two. So you'll continue doing those until you complete 10. Then, like I said, be creative with pushing your cardio up a little bit higher. Do the lap in between each one if you want to really want to be successful, or just continue through with the lap at the end. So I hope you've enjoyed this workout again. I'll show you it one more time. Feel free to take a picture. I know some of y'all got those smartphones and all that and all those gizmos and gadgets so that you screenshot and stuff. So get a pic, work it out. Of course, you know, I get videos of people that have done it. And they haven't signed a waiver yet, so I don't try to post them doing it or nothing. But it's great to see that some people are taking it serious to actually do the workout. So if you see the workout and it's something you want to try, screenshot it, DM me a video of it. If you feel free, like if you feel like you want to share it and allow me to share it, then I'll share it. And, and possibly you can join me one day for a workout. Till next time, I'm Worthington, and this is your workouts with Worthington. Peace.